Hello YouTube and welcome back everyone to the hub of Roblox, bringing you another awesome Roblox update this week again like always. In today's epic video, we'll be sharing some of the easiest working methods this month to be able to get rare pets in Roblox Adopt Me, along with all of the details too. It's going to be pretty wild, so before we start, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel too, and without any more interruptions, let's just go ahead and jump right into it. Within the massive platform of Roblox lies one of the most popular games on the platform to take the community by storm, and that is of course Adopt Me. This game entails players that focus on taking care of virtual pets that can be traded with a plethora of other players. It's recently been massively popular on YouTube with huge Roblox YouTubers making a variety of different role-playing content based on the game mode, raking in millions upon millions of views every week. The pets that can be hatched in this game mode are grouped into five different classes, all based around rarity and cost. These groups are common, uncommon, rare, ultra-rare, and legendary, and once hatched, pets can grow from their starting status as newborns, growing into juniors, preteens, teens, post-teens, and eventually becoming full-grown. If a player has four fully-grown pets of the same type, they can combine them to form a neon pet, and four fully-grown neon pets can also be combined to form a mega neon pet. It's pretty much the trading card game of Roblox really when you think about it. It's no surprise a type of game like this has exceeded popularity on the platform, because we have seen time and time again that trading card games and gotcha-like mobile games like Genshin Impact blow up in attention and many players almost get addicted to pulling new and unique characters in which they have to have the best one or the specific one they're looking for. With how popular the game is getting and the insane amount of new players joining in on all of the fun, we are bound to see many new changes coming its way this year for sure. And that brings us to the first popular method to getting rare pets, which is trading. It's important to explore different areas around the map to find players you haven't seen before to increase your chance of finding a rare pet that you want. But keep in mind, with this method, you are going to need an inventory of pets yourself as well to be able to offer to other people. Think of it as your own Adopt Me currency, other than bucks. Always be sure to reach out to people who are willing to trade, because you never know what someone might offer. Many people have different tastes, so a pet you may think is extremely rare and cool might be completely worthless to the person who actually owns it. Use that to your advantage and start hunting around for the rarest pets you can and start trading like crazy. Another really easy method is to simply purchase them from players. If there is a pet or item you really want and have not been able to get your hands on for a while, some people are not opposed to simply selling them to you if it's worth it to them. You should really only do this if you've tried everything you can to find people to trade with but with no luck, because there could potentially be people out there wanting to scam you by requesting an absurd amount of money for a pet you could find with just a little bit of more hatching of eggs, so don't come off as too desperate. Be sure to always offer something reasonable, and before that, ask them how much they like the particular pet you're asking for, because if it's something they want to keep, they are probably going to want a whole lot more for it, so just ask. And the last method we have is going to be searching for codes. Every so often, Roblox will hold an event of some kind and will release a handful of codes that you can enter in Roblox to receive different kinds of in-game items. In Adopt Me events, they almost always release codes that deliver rare pets or sometimes higher ones, along with some awesome accessories as well. A simple Google search can bring a bunch of usable codes right in front of you whenever there is an active event, so always be on the lookout for some sweet chances to get some free Adopt Me pets. But let us know any other ways you guys have gotten rare pets and adopt me down in the comments below. Thank you all so much for watching and if you enjoyed, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel too if you haven't already for more of the best Roblox updates on YouTube. You can also tap the notification bell icon as well to not miss out on any of our future uploads that we post either. This is the Hub of Roblox signing off and we will catch you all in the next one.